Good morning to my First Aid family. My name is Brooke Vasile. I'm hailing out of Germantown, Maryland. Can't wait to debate you all at the desk in two months' time. Special shout out to you, though, Stephen A. You have been holding my GQ spot real nice and warm with those Time 4 suits, and I appreciate it. But style make the man, not the brand, baby. Now, anyways, let's get into the real substance. I am full of that, too. So, LeBron James, is he responsible for the current super team coaches that we see in the NBA? I'll say without a doubt, yes, but I would take that as the greatest compliment. And it's pretty evident if we see the actions of some of the players and teams this past offseason. So, for example, let's look at Kevin Durant, who could have joined Miami, could have joined Boston, could have started an amazing franchise there. But no, he had to already join an established franchise to have a secure bona fide route to the NBA Finals, which I'm sure we can all agree Warriors are going to the Finals again. And then you look at uh, New York and their acquiring of uh, Joe Kim Noah or Derrick Rose, players I believe are injury ridden and are past their prime. And these are the players you want to provide false hope to the New York public, having them think they can actually take on the Cavaliers and Eastern Conference. Good luck with that. And also, another shout out to my man Max Kellerman for shouting out Raekwon's Only Built for Cuban Links, one of the best albums ever. Salute, my man.